Hello everyone. In this video, we will discuss about launch files. What is a launch file and why do we need a launch files? And we will demonstrate that using a turtle sim package. Before moving forward, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video and share it. Why do we need launch files? The first reason is to avoid running multiple nodes separately in the system so that we can automate the system to run multiple nodes with just a single command. That is the main purpose of launch files to automate the running of multiple nodes with a single command. Besides, we, it also gives you the benefits of describing the configuration of the system. Now, what is the configuration of the system? With the configuration, you can tell what programs to run and where to run those programs. Either maybe different machines or different processes and what arguments that we need to pass to either of the nodes or to any of the nodes and the fourth is raw specific conventions so that we can reuse components or the nodes by giving some different arguments this is the main purpose and lastly the launch files can also be written in python xml or yml format in modern uh, ROS or ROS2 we use uh, python format because that is the modern one moving further now we will demonstrate using the turtle sim package and before moving further let us first understand what task we want to achieve the goal of this task is to launch two turtles and making turtle 2 follow turtle 1 without giving command to turtle 2 meaning we will give only command to turtle 1 and the turtle 2 has to follow turtle 1 and this all the process has to be done by just using or launching just one launch file now let us see an example over here we have uh, one node that is of the turtle one which will subscribe to the command velocity and which will publish the post which we will see it on the screen similarly the turtle 2 has the command velocity as the subscriber and then it will publish on the topic that is turtle 2 post now what we want to do is we want to take the information from the post of turtle 1 and give command velocity to turtle 2 so that the turtle 2 can follow turtle 1 and that we will achieve by a third node which is already written in the package of turtle sim so which whose name is mimic now the input of this the input topic for this node is input pose and the output is a command velocity but what we want to achieve with this node is that it should subscribe to turtle sim 1 pose and then it should publish on the command velocity 2 so now we use the configuration uh, of the launch files to transform to convert first this topic from input pose to turtle pose and output command velocity to turtle to command velocity so by doing that we will achieve something like this we will change the topic name input topic name to turtle one post of this node and then we will change the topic name of the command velocity to turtle to command velocity so that now it can take the post from this and this node will transform the post of the turtle one into the commands for turtle two so that the turtle two can follow turtle one for now you don't have to understand what is going on inside this node the only thing you need to understand is how we are going to use launch files to launch the systems and how we can make it work and in the next video we will discuss about creating a package and building the launch files from scratch to see an example moving further let us now see the demonstration using a turtle sim package for that you need to go to your chrome and type ros to humble to go to the documentation and now navigate to tutorials cli tools now using turtle sim ros2 nrp we will be using turtle sim package therefore make sure that you have updated it and run this code to install the turtle sim package and then using this you can check whether you have installed or not when you have this then now we will see how we can use launch files to create now go to intermediate go to launch creating a launch file so we will use this example to see how we can execute it now to do that first open your terminal navigate to your ROS2 workspace and then in SRC in SRC what you have to do is first you have to make a folder of launch of name launch we will do that first now we do have a folder and now you need to create a launch file by this name you can create any but the extension should be .py over here we, are, we will be using the python if you want xml you can go for xml or yml now we will be using python so let us now open the launch folder over here 
we will go into the raw workspace src here we do have a launch we will open that using vs code just to have a good interface of what we are doing and now let us create a new file with the name turtle sim mimic launch.py over here now we do have a file we will copy paste the content over here and i will explain you now what is happening over here so this is a launch file we will take the launch description to describe uh, all the configuration of the system and now we will take the nodes from uh, launch ROS package from actions we will take the node this will describe our nodes in that we will launch the description and now we will have three nodes over here we will be launching using this launch file the first node will be from the turtle sim package and the node name will be turtle sim node this is the name which is given as sim which will remain same for both of these and the second file the second node we have over here is also turtle sim and from the turtle sim node meaning that these two are same only we are giving a different namespace that is turtle sim 1 over here and turtle sim 2 over here so that we can now differentiate two nodes and now we are using the same node for two times using launch files and the third node that we have is a mimic which is a remapping that is changing the topic name from input post to turtle 1 post and changing the topic of command velocity output to the turtle to command velocity so that it can subscribe now to turtle one post and now give commands to turtle two post so these are the three nodes we will be launching using a launch file now we have understanding of what exactly happening over here and now to execute that go to your terminal and then go to the launch file that you have now if you see you have only one file over here we will launch that file using ROS to launch is a command that you have to use and then the file name. This will launch the file. So when you do that, you should see two windows of turtles. We will see this is one over here, one terminal turtle, and this is the another turtle. So which you should visualize something like this. And now what we will do is we will give commands to turtle one and we will make the turtle two follow turtle one using this. So using this launch file we have described, now you can read all of this data to see what is going on, how both of this two launch and this is the third node that we have, how they're launching. Now, we will give this command, which is to give the command velocity to turtle1 and we will not give any commands to turtle2. Now when we run this, what is going on here is we are giving commands to only turtle1 and the turtle2 is following turtle1. So these are the nodes that are doing the task and using a single launch file. Now we have launched three nodes and they are working. And similarly, you can go to RQT, you can also in one terminal execute RQT graph to see this over here the turtle sim1 is taking command velocity from terminal and now it is giving the pose which we are visualizing over here and the mimic is taking the pose of this and that is converting that into the command velocity for turtle2 now the turtle2 will take this and it will display this on the screen so this is how we can achieve uh, functionality using the launch files running multiple nodes at the same time and in the next video we will see how we can create our own package our own launch file and how we can execute multiple nodes at the same time using launch files. Thank you for watching the video.